some people might be thinking, wait a minute, how can a well-off university in a well-off country like Germany need the money for an elite sport like rowing? That's crazy. Let's take a closer look. Right at the end of World War II, this town was flattened. I mean, 90% was destroyed. The rowing clubs with boats that survived had no place to store their boats. So the university took the initiative and built a boat house. This is the student rowing program at the University of Würzburg. They have won numerous championships around the world and they've trained and educated hundreds of athletes and students. Today I'm going to show you why this is all about to go away. So, what's the problem? There's a popular rowing education and training program, great working relationships with the neighboring rowing clubs, and recreationally, people of all ages are taking part of rowing here in Würzburg. There's even a rowing team for people with disabilities too. Everything is fantastic, except this. The University Boathouse. Over the past 70 years, it has given the sport so much. Not only storing the boats safely, but also giving the students and community a wonderful place to gather. After a number of floods and many years of service, it's now time to say goodbye. So, to keep the tradition alive, we're building a new boathouse. A bit larger, more flexible, and designed to serve both the sport and community alike. The ground floor storage area includes an intelligent rack system and has a higher ceiling. The first floor houses a flexible kitchen, changing rooms, and a multi-purpose room for classes and events. At first, 1 million euros does seem like a lot of money for this relatively small building. But considering that it's located in a flood area and that it's a part of the university, both the flood and fire safety protection requirements for a public building are not to be underestimated. Should we not be able to reach the 1 million euro goal, we have two backup plans. With 300,000, we can construct a storage building able to carry a future first floor. And with only 100,000, we can build a storage unit able to protect and secure the valuable boats the university currently has. Both plans will be able to still support the student rowing program until a future opportunity comes along. So what is it about rowing that's so good? Well, it's a great recreational sport. People of all ages can do it. It's easy on the joints, and you can use the entire body. The whole family can row together in nature. And it's all about team cooperation. There is a competitive side too. Clubs and schools around the world have been very active locally, regionally, and nationally. In fact, here in Würzburg, rowers have won gold medals at world championships and even the Olympics. But the challenge for many people interested in fitness is that they think that rowing is really hard. Thinking about the Greek slaves and the Olympic athletes at the end of the race, it just looks exhausting. Actually though, recreational rowing is very, very easy. The main focus is, is rowing in sync together. And by just using the fingertips, there is very little effort. If you want more of a workout, great just row a bit harder. The location of the boathouse is really special. This lagoon is directly connected to the river and offers a perfect place to learn how to row. School children, teenagers, and adults new to the sport can learn in a safe place. Now, is this project something really to support? Well, if you're into sports and understand the importance of supporting other athletes in need, yeah. If you want to have some cool giveaways from Germany, yeah. If you want to make sure that such a long and meaningful tradition should live on, yes. 
Today, the university is faced with many complex financial challenges regarding infrastructural and critical important services for the operations to remain functioning. Thus, many projects like the Boathouse have been put on a long waiting list. And as the Athletic Booster Club, we completely understand the situation and see this project as an honor, a responsibility, and a great opportunity for us. In the name of all the past students and teachers, as well as the future ones to come, please support this project by making a donation and sending this message on to all your friends and family, because together we can make this happen. Thanks.